everybody. Time for street food. Korean street food. I'm going to show you how to make French fries corn dog. In Korean, a kamja hot dog. You may get confused. What is a hot dog and corn dog is different? Yes, in Korea, we call corn dog as a hot dog. Hot dog on the stick. But there are so many varieties. Vendors are making all kinds of different versions. This is my favorite version and also I heard that so many people love it because you can enjoy french fries and also hot dog here. You can eat it just a big huge one, it can be one meal. But for some reason, this uh, hot dog is also called Mandugi hot dog. So Mandugi is kind of a you know, character name. In 1990s, this guy is always chased by ghost. It's also called Goblin's Club. In Korea, Goblin is monstrous monstrous you know some creature and always really scary and it has a, always a carry really huge huge like club really spiky stuff is there so that they can attack so easily and also ugly hot dog it's ugly it's because it doesn't look nice and smooth that's why it's ugly hot dog so easy recipe let's get started i'm going to make a kind of yeast dough i just boil some water See, this is a half cup hot water. And then I will fill it up with this cold water. One cup, it's a warm water. Sugar, two tablespoons. Two tablespoons sugar. And mix. And then one package of dry yeast, active dry yeast. And this yeast is uh, like around two teaspoons. So just uh, let it sit around a couple of minutes until this yeast is uh, well, well melted. So now I'm going to add salt and also flour. Half a teaspoon salt. Look at this, as yeast is well melted. And then flour is uh, one cup plus a three quarter cup. One cup. This is a half a cup. Quarter cup. And mix. I'm using my rice scoop. Rice scoop is so good. I always use this when I mix something. I want this dough without any lumps and very smooth. So I don't use any egg here, egg or milk, just the water and flour. So easy, simple. You see? Oh, nice. Look at that. Good. I'm going to set aside. We need to ferment to one hour. So after one hour, we can start cooking. And then now, this is potato. We gotta make a kind of a French fries. So this is huge potato, almost one pound this is. So I'm going to peel this and cut it into small cubes. Now I'm boiling my water uh, because I, I will blanch my potato. So first I need to cut into small pieces. Around a quarter inch cubes. You see, this is water, and because I want to remove the starch.
All these black dots, I gotta get rid of this. This water is boiling. I will just strain this. You see, water a little bit milky. Blanch. And for two minutes, two minutes after I will strain this and also rinse in cold water. So I will use this beef hot dog, uncured beef hot dogs. And I'm going to use four. Two minutes I cooked and I'm going to strain this. So this is my cotton cloth and potato is wet, so I like to dry out. You guys can use paper towels. And dry. And dry this. And then put it back. I will add some flour. One, two, and coat this with the flour so that later it's going to stick to the batter very well. And just dry also. It's sometimes like a kind of a sticky stuff, slimy thing, I don't like that. So I like to dry off each one. These are wooden chopsticks. I'm going to skewer this hot dog. And just push and all going to the center. So the, the tip of this your chopstick is around here. And I like to make this one small size, just a cut half. I prepared everything. Dough is made and potato and this uh, hot dog, all skewered. Now I have to wait until this dough is well risen. Now I'm heating my oil. This is a corn oil and around like a three inch deep. We can start the cooking around 320. Look at that, like this. Let's do You see, bubbling, nicely in the frying. So this is right temperature. Bangaru, you know, bread crumbs. And you just for this amount, you need only half a cup, but I added more here. And also potato. So potato, I'm going to put this. Yeah, look at this well risen. Okay, here. And then So I can add one more here. Nicely, this look at that beautiful color. Beautiful, isn't it? I think not ugly. Until these are golden brown. It takes around five to six minutes. Okay, I will just put it on my strainer. <laughs> Goblin's Club. <laughs> okay, 
Let's do this small. Small thing is a piece of cake making so easy. So these three guys, two small guys and one big guy is still you know, frying. And then now, sugar. This is two tablespoons of sugar. This is optional, but in Korea, I'm showing you how they serve. So sugar. Keep turning the, until all sides are just golden brown and crunchy. It's done. Turn off. Large one, two small goblins, goblins clubs. <laughs> you can attack because it's a spike things. <laughs> Making this thing is so fun because French fries looks so crunchy and crispy and look so good. Everybody loves this. Once in a while, deep fry the food. We need that, you know, because so delicious. And then now, ketchup and uh, mustard also. Usually, each one, just you can drizzle this yellow mustard and ketchup. But today, I'm so happy. I'm too excited. So let's make some calligraphy. <laughs> ketchup. Yay! Let me taste. Mmm. <laughs> Hot dog is really hot and crunchy. The French fries is so crunchy and sweet. This bread is yummy, yummy. Fun, fun to eat and also tasty. Sugar, mustard, ketchup, it make it more tasty. Today, we made Korean style French fries corn dog. In Korean, gamja hot dog. Hot dog. <laughs> Enjoy my recipe. See you next time. Bye.